I just happened to check out my YouTube page tonight, and I noticed something rather strange about, you know, a couple of my videos. But before I show you those, check this out. Okay, this is the video I made about, you know, how the Pope was behind all those homophobic laws in Switzerland and whatnot. Everything looks normal, you know, the hits are kind of low because they're obviously, you know, blocking the hits to some extent on YouTube. We caught them doing that many times. Or my Mark of the Beast video that I did a while ago, a couple, three years ago. You know, everything looks normal, right? It just shows the hits, it shows comments and stuff like that. If you scroll down, everything seems okay, right? Now check out this. If you go to the global warming video that I did, where it has to do something with, you know, global government and enforcing the uh, mark of the beast, all of a sudden this weird thing shows up on the bottom of my video in regards to how they're trying to explain it away and make it look like it's legit global warming, even though we know it's, it's bogus. And, uh, but here's what got me. I put this video up the other day. Hits are extremely low considering the topic. And Encyclopedia Botanica, they put a link underneath here about contrails. Now check out what they said here. Because in the video, I show absolute proof there's a difference between contrails and chemtrails, where the chemtrails are actually chemicals. And I showed all sorts of documentation with people that are testing these chemtrails when they waft down in the neighborhoods. And so they put these little disclaimers up on our videos now to try to make people believe that we're idiots and they've got all the proof here. And to think that they're using something like Wikipedia, where it's a public domain kind of an encyclopedia, where anybody can put anything they want on Wikipedia, it's not a valid source. So I just thought I'd put that out there to show that they're actually a little frightened about the truth that we're presenting out there. For them to go to this length to actually start putting articles on our videos, underneath our videos for everybody to see, so as to make it look like what we're sharing is bogus and what they're sharing is real. But then again, in the age of fake news and the age of lying, we all know what's up. But there's a lot of people out there that don't. So spread the word that YouTube, as we all know, has been compromised a long time ago when Google bought it out. Fake news is fake news, no matter where it props up. So I thought I'd just share this to let you know that I had nothing to do with putting this statement in here about contrails. Because there's a big difference between water vapor and actual chemicals that are killing people and getting them sick. Thank you for watching. God bless.